Now we're going to do coming into Alan's house from north out the window of my car. And let's hope we get something here. Now we're very close to Laurel Grove, Oregon, where Alan Kelly lives. We're coming down Highway 101. And uh, this is a very woodsy area, but we're only less than a mile from the Pacific Ocean. Uh, it's an, always a very beautiful drive. Along the way, there's several lakes. And of course, in Bandon, there's the uh, river, the Coquille River. Um, this is an interesting jam business over here. Here's a golf course over here. And uh, along the way, you just see it's just basically still like an undeveloped area, even though there's quite a lot of population here. There's a lot of blueberry ranches here where you can get the best blueberries in the world fresh off the bush, or you can pick them yourself. Um, we're coming in closer to Banda now, to Allen's house now. We're on Highway 101 going south. Uh, and you can see there's uh, a number of activities and old houses along the road here. This area right here is called Laurel Grove. And um, it's not really a town or anything. It's just a rural suburb. Town grocery store is right here. It's called Laurel Grove Store. And it's over here on right after this wood business. And it's right over here on the left. To the right over here is a lake actually down the road there. And uh, this store up here, Zumwalt's, was bought by some Eskimos from Alaska who are not doing well and they're selling it already. So we're almost to Mastel Lane where Alan Kelly lives. And uh, we'll turn in there and we'll have the camera going until we get to the house. And now you'll know what it's like coming home to Mastel Lane, six miles south of Bandon, Oregon. Here it is, Mastel Lane. And this is Alan Kelly's woods here. He owns these trees, this woods. He doesn't maintain anything. The trees fall on the road. He has junk cars. Here's one junk truck sitting in the road. And there's lots of other junk cars around here. You can see them over this way, up this way. This is the house. These are the junk cars. This white stuff over here, he did this on purpose to make the property ugly so that the neighbor could not sell her property. Over here you see all the other cars. This is what it's like. This is the entryway and I'm going to park right here. <laughs> 